Welcome back, guys. Infinite Gamer here. We will be playing a bit of uh, a bit of Survival again today. It's been a while since I've played this. There's been quite a few updates came out. The, um, the devs have been doing fantastic work in it. Um, we will be starting a new game today. Um, and this won't be as long as my normal streams. I'm not feeling too well today, so I will probably be putting it a bit short. Added male and female. I'll change the name yet there. Let's have a look at the female character since that's what we played with before. So yeah, looking for the patch notes and that, they've um, they've added coals and reefs, um, vegetation in the water, um, they've added the ability to throw spears, they've added fish, you are also able to um, Game sound is drowning out my voice. Better. That would be because there's no game sound. Not the uh, game sound down of it. There we are. Yeah. So they have added quite a bit to it. And uh, and welcome, Fusion. I do apologise. Just ignored you there. Um, this is a development build that I'm playing on. So there may be... Well, no, I'm not going to say there may be, there will be a lot of issues. But I just wanted to sort of show people the direction that they're going with, um, with Surf Island. Because I personally think that they're doing a cracking job of it. Right. Yeah, well, this is fun. Yes, it's that one. Yeah, yeah, please stay for about 10 minutes, but I'm here. Man, that's all that matters to me, even if you just jumped in for two seconds, I wouldn't care, mate. I appreciate you coming along. No matter what. Right, let's have a look. But yeah, I know that they've added fish and the ability to actually spear fish. Um, pretty cool, isn't it? Um, I'm not sure if they've. Let's try that again. Yeah, I'm not um not entirely sure what else is uh else has been added. Oh, actually, I'll have to explain why I'm doing that. Yo, Remus, how you doing? Mm. Huh. Huh. Oh, you can actually, yeah, that can actually break the call. Jazz, thank you for the host, my main man. How are you doing, bro? How are you doing, Remus? Confusion, I'm just going to say. to stick and make ourselves disappear. That's that some of these new things that they've added. I'm good, I'm level 42 and 76 running around in T60. Jesus Christ, man. 
I've been playing past me. Just, uh, it's been a bit annoying. I've been bloody stuck at a uh, trying to sort the place out a bit, packing stuff up, whatnot. Ready for a freaking move? She got crap, she does have crap. Uh, everybody else has been having issues with um, restream for some like, bizarre reason. It's um, not showing up my viewers right. Apparently, I just have one view on Mixer. I know you will. Um, oh, a knife. I want to pick up this pick. It would be quite funny if the crabs did start that. I'm not going to be doing a um, box stream today, it's just going to be a short one, I am feeling at my best. I do apologise. I just uh, I really fancied just jumping back on this. So. Having a fun. you've been up to on um bullet send six and remus need to jump back on that uh, which i probably will tomorrow too fingers crossed if all goes well start dancing and oh, that would be rather amusing also glad to see you didn't go through to only streaming on mixer um, I will probably be doing that at some point I do apologize Remus um, I just didn't today oh that's bad um, really because I haven't finished setting up my mixer and everything but I might just make it mixer on YouTube I don't really know yet I'm still in Still in two minds with everything. Hang on. Which uh actually have it on the end. Oh can as well. No I definitely got crabs. If you can have more than one on there. Um it's been awesome to have slapped them up. Jesus. Mm. No, they did say that they've got quite a bit to work on with the um, with like the weapons and fishing and whatnot. Unfortunately, we cannot cook the fish or the crab yet. We'll be coming in in the next update, I believe they said, which is um, a bit sweet. Oops, 
Ei, kuule. Oh, the fish is something new, can talk on a queen with a bunch of high level players, use a pot of ammo and died a few times, we didn't kill the queen, but it was an experience. Yeah man, I bet that was freaking awesome. I've wanted to do that myself, I've really been looking forward to doing it. Or oh, giving it a shot and that. I've been trying to find people to um to go with with the new codes and whatnot. Well this was sweet but I have to go enjoy. Thank you for coming along Fusion. Do appreciate it bro. Uh, have yourself a good day or night. How's it going, Pimpin? How are you doing? Um, welcome along. Thank you. We're looking at a uh, development build of the violin. 0.6. I'm to test out a few new features. I've done a stream on it in a while. How much it? That's it. Sounds very echoey today. That's where issues. Hmm. I hope not. Like that. Never be too. sure about that. I'll have to uh, check it when I'm off off stream. It may just be um, <clears throat> it may just be because I've not not been on it in a while. I'll probably end up changing one of the settings when I bloody realised or something. <coughs> Don't know if I'm gonna be able to get this high enough. <coughs> Don't even know if this will work, did it burn? Give us some more. 
Nope. Really just wanna know if this will work. Welcome along to my stream of babbling. On an island, middle of nowhere. Uh, game says it's good. Is this PC or PS4? Uh, it's PC it is. Still very, very early access. Well, not, yeah, early access now. <clears throat> like I said, I'm playing on a development build at the moment. Um, just because I've added quite a few new features. I thought I'd check it out again. I've not played it in a while. Um, I wanted to test out what the uh, other players look like as well. Because they only used to have uh, male characters of standard, but they're actually given the choice of male and female now. It's awesome. Oh, okay. Oh, approaching. Oh. What's the note? I'm to friggin... Oh, I don't know what happened. No! <laughs> I think I've lost my spear. Look at the fucking tree. <laughs> okay, did not expect that to happen. That's my own fault. Gonna run me for the tutorial now of finding and um, finding and making an axe, I believe. Yeah, man. Any, for any people that are interested in um, interested in survival games and enjoy playing them, you should um, definitely keep tabs on this game. Um, I want. There's not a hell of a lot of content at the moment. They've only just started adding. Um, only just started adding what we call it, like creatures, fish, and that sort of thing. Um, but they're doing it at quite a good pace, and they're um, they're really dedicated. They've got their own Discord that you can you can join. You can keep up to date with them. You can chat with them. You can give them ideas. Um, they're really, really good with the community when it comes down to um, that aspect. And yeah, the uh, the realism that they've put into this game is unbelievable. Um, but they have uh, they have said that they want to kind of kind of make it so it's not too realistic that it's too hard. But they want to keep a bit of realism to it, keep that survival aspect to the game. Where's that fucking be that I got my axe? What? Got my axe, bloody spear, I can't believe I got it stuck. So is it full survival like base building and all that fun? It is indeed. Um, and to do the base building it isn't as simple as just going into a menu and um or going into a menu and being able to build you actually have to craft um these certain items to be able to then pick up and then you can use them to want to create foundations, want to create support and want to create the actual um, floor in itself um, and then moving and all that sort of stuff. I will demonstrate that to you in a minute. It's running me for the tutorial so it'll get me to do it. The, uh, the fire starting and all that stuff is it's immense on it. I had so much fun doing that. I've done a little tutorial because it is um, it's quite difficult. Uh, mm. uh, to get the hang of it. Ha. 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 Oh, 
probably not going to be able to get them. Mm. see. Don't play realistic games, unless your game is erosion and plate tectonics, then I'm not touching it. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if they added something like that into this. Like I said, they are still working on the game. This is a development build. It's why I think the graphics aren't as uh, aren't as great as they normally are. The graphics are beautiful in the game. Um, but there is okay. So now I need Tinder, which you can get. Oh, there's my brats. Coconuts. Really cool, I like that. It's a big draw for me in seven days to die. You have to make certain things to be able to make other pieces. Yeah, it's a very, very early build. That man. Yeah, if it's something that you uh, you think you would be interested in, I don't know when they're planning on having like, a proper release of the game out, I'm not too sure. But, um,. Uh, you should join a Discord, definitely, just keep on tabs with them. Um, and, I mean, you can chat to one of the devs I've been chatting to all day today, to be fair. Um, just about random stuff, to be fair, stuff to do with the game, whatnot. Different things that they're adding and different things that we can do at the moment. and get to the base building bit for you. But you can uh, you can actually make this fire into a stone fire, which means that when the uh, fire goes out you don't have to go get another piece of firewood and rebuild the whole fire from scrap. So I thought it was awesome. And I just love the way that you know the wood actually piles on, and the uh, the more wood you pile on, the hotter the fire gets, and then standing too close to it can actually cause your character to overheat, um, which then causes damage to yourself. It's never good. What's the remember? Seen of her Grammy and Southern that playing extension. Looks extremely fun. Don't fucking blade. I don't have got much. Nope, turn it. We will be able to do with it. Remember, right? Can you? Sweet. I need. In. Here. Um, I'm not quite sure if you can do that, but I know that if you have a, uh, I think if you've got a building with, which is made out of like wood and whatnot, um, it does, um, it does actually start to damage a building and then it'll break it and the structures actually have, um, integrity. So if you're trying to build something extremely high, you need to place more supports underneath it to, you know, be able to withstand the, um, the weight. Mm. 
Um, it, it's surprising how much detail they've gone into with this. I've never played a survival game quite like it. Uh, I'm probably going to end up dying in a minute. Uh, yeah. so you sort of see like the way that the crafting's done in this here using different tools using the dagger you can um using a like stone dagger you can cut things using a chisel you can drill things and chisel things um Using a stone, you can nap things. Um, they plan on adding loads. actually have to like apply pressure using S and then uh, spin using the mouse wheel and then once you get up to that first line the tinder should then start to smoke I remember that hopefully I will get to there we are that starts smoking then you got a left click to blow Wind is taken into account with this. Um, you've got wind taken into account, uh, the actual sun itself, so if it's daylight, it's going to be easier, whereas if it's night time. UK Gamer, thank you for the host. Ooh, thank you, Craft, for that little tip there. I didn't know that. Well, I bet to do that, just an option. Thank you. Very much obliged. No worries, Remus. Yeah, you can sort of see the extent of uh, realism that they've put into this. Obviously, if your tools are wet as well, so say you get to make a fire and then uh, as you run into your fire, it rains and your drill board and stick get wet. You'll see the uh, the little water icon on the water dropper icon on the right. That'll have like a blue bar under it. And you'll basically have to um, do the same thing of like spinning the stick until that disappears. So you've got to basically dry out your wood and your tools, and then you'll be able to start this. And voila! So, fire. And here you are, pimping, just to do you. Stand next to it, you will. Don't actually like set a light at the moment, but I imagine at some point you probably will. I'll probably add that uh, feature in, I'd imagine. So, I need to find a fan palm tree. What the bad is that you get fiber from? For a workbench, you can use uh, big stones, which I don't actually think I have any red here. Um, or you can use a big enough tree stump. Okay. 
Maybe we can look for down a tree that will be big enough. Big enough. pretty awesome the way that they've done it pretty amazing like i absolutely loved it i'll um before i come off i'll jump onto my other game if it'll run in this build i'm not too sure if it will um like as you can see this is like basically a crafting table you can place different items on it and then you can basically tie different items together I should look if I can catch it. Uh. The only problem with uh, starting, yeah, not how long the one-hour process is got this. Uh, I did figure it was you, Craft, and uh, thank you for coming along as well. I do appreciate it. I know you said you don't normally watch uh, live streams. like tie these two sticks together then this is how I will show you Pimpin the base building uh, it's st still too early access for the story they have said that they've got one in the works um, but yeah I think at the moment it is a bit, uh, a bit early for that I think they just want to actually get the game, uh, game up and running properly one I've created here is that just bought the this and there it's going to start getting pitch oh fucking okay, back uh. but they have said that there will be a story uh, I'm not too sure what that story will be um, I'm quite interested to find out myself and um, they have said there will be multiplayer added into it, but I think that'll be um, that'll be quite a while in the way that will. Okay, oh. okay that rock on. The night it does get a little bit dark, just a little bit. But some of the uh, some of the screenshots and stuff that I've got, it's um, it's, it's a beautiful game. Some of the um, sunrises and sunsets, just amazing. Uh, one of the really cool features I've added, I think it's Cloudy at the moment, is um, star constellations. They're actually like correct. Um, they look awesome, and you can actually find like the North Star and then use that as a way of navigating around. Um, around the map and sort of not losing your way. How did I like my hat? No clue where the hell I put that. Hmm. See if I can uh... So all you can do without a bed is you can nap. Um, whereas if you've got a bed, you can actually uh, you can actually sleep for as long as you like. Like you can choose how long you sleep. There we are. Brought me to death. Let's see if I'm just This is damn dark. <laughs> yeah, it is dark, man. It is really dark. You can craft torches on it though, so there's ways and means around it. There's a bloody axe hiding between all that wood. Ha! 
with me. I could have swore it had just gone day like them and I was waking up. I was probably seeing things. Probably just me seeing things. Um, do that stone. Okay. Uh, I literally started a new game craft uh, just for this build because I couldn't uh, mine didn't I couldn't tell if mine was running smooth or not so I didn't want to risk it on a stream I think if I just start a new one but I um, I will be jumping onto um, on smooth one just before I come off just to uh, sort of show um, show people sort of what you can do on it. Yeah, if it, if you're into survival games, when this game's fully um, fully complete and out there, honestly, it'll it'll be amazing. Truly, truly amazing. I think this is making a base marker, which is a floor. I oh, will actually be able to show you sort of how the building works. And what I'll do then, um, probably only going to be on for about another half an hour. I'll uh, jump over onto Mobile Safe and I'll see if my buildings are actually still there. You can sort of see what you can uh, accomplish. I'm going to put that before being. So, yeah, there really is so much to look forward to, there honestly is. I, um, I genuinely can't wait. Just to see this build slightly finished. It's got so much potential. I really hope the devs just keep working hard on it. <clears throat> like they have been. And um, I love the way that they've been interacting with the, uh, with the community as well. It's brilliant. Why is that not letting me? Ah, there we are. But as you can see, like building the... Um, just to play that again. <coughs> so to build the uh, the base base floor, you need this base marker, which you actually have to craft. And then you can like attach anything. So pretty much, as long as it doesn't uh, I think flat in fully with the ground, it won't. You can also uh, change the shape square to a triangle. Saw some really awesome builds that people have done, some that craft have done that were absolutely amazing, like <coughs> at least I think it was you craft. Mm. Up you and then so that'll be like your floor. Then you can add these for the support markers. Which can also change the length, so you could make it smaller. And then what you could do is make a long one and actually rotate it on it. Oh no, won't go. So you could do it like that and then but make yourself a little teepee. Wanted to. Yeah, that's the first build that I did, which is like this little TV thing. Pretty awesome. Then obviously once you've done that... Uh, to be honest, they aren't all that hard to build. No, they're not once you get used to it. Like, it took me a while to get, get ropes around, like getting the decent builds and whatnot done, but once you figure out the, the physics behind it, because the integrity and whatnot, you know, it's, it's quite easy to do and it works awesome. Now that's how you do building a base in a game. Pretty much, man, I've never seen it like 
in quite so much depth. I'm not sure if they've added anything new to it recently. Um, I've not seen anything in the um, in the patch note. Right, as you'll see here then, um, it'll come up say like you can upgrade it basically, actually build the thing. And to do that you have to go collect the materials, that's dirt, sticks and stone. So for instance, um, then it'll run over to it and then you'll see how much has been put into there. Um, it does take quite a bit to do. And the reason why I'm probably not going to... Yeah. Yeah. Oh, can you not put those in there? No. Um, that's not needed. Do the wood stumps. Yeah, I never realised, ah, oh, it's not fucking wood stumps, that's why it's fucking fire, Not like doing it. Then I haven't played this for a while. Then bloody craft mode as well, that's probably why. Yeah, I mean, it is. The way that they've done it, it gives you so much freedom in builds because you can sort of try and build these structures that you wouldn't think of with other base building because they just give you the walls and the pieces that you can make. It limits you, whereas with this, it gives you the tools to make a building and then you make what you want to make, basically. Um, and that's one of the things that I, I really love about it. And here you are, I'll show you the support marker now. It's so open to create designs and then where and stand on the floor and feel like. Oh, I didn't realise you were. Uh, what is it you actually do then? Do you do building? Actually on the building site sort of thing? Architect, something like that? Looks like it'd be a lot of fun and very challenging at the same time. Like okay, seven days did. Yes, but man, this is way beyond that. I understand the activity of building Conan in seven days had the same concept. Well, there are a few shapes at the surface marks. Oh. Um, which one's that? Is that the base mark or the um, the walls and whatnot? I noticed that when I was building with them before, you sometimes have these just odd shapes and certain things weren't being filled properly. But yeah, so basically, to actually build, if I remember right, using the. Um, I don't know actually put a wall in you actually have to make a frame so it's got to be an actual square frame that and the right I dropped you get rid of my camera drop and then that should there you are then you can change the direction in which the um used to be a change up in which the force facing doesn't seem to want to work for me at the moment there. Done that. That. That's that. So, what I'll do now, I'll jump back into one of my other saves. I'll sort of show you one of the builds that I've done. Always put it in your shirt pocket, that's not a bad idea actually. Yeah, I never thought of that. Yeah, it's so. Um, so, load. Um, what else? 
for this. No, this build, because uh, this is an old save, I don't know if it's going to run as well with the uh, with this build, development build. If it doesn't, I'll jump back um, into one of the older builds. Work better in there. I know earlier when I came on, the buildings weren't showing up. I'm hoping somebody did mention a fix. I'm hoping that works. So. Ah, fingers crossed. Ooh. Okay. Hey, just to load. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Pointing off into the sunset background. Cheers, man. Um, it's actually a Red Dead uh, Redemption GIF that I have uh, for when I'm playing Red Dead. I was a bit of a rush getting the stream set up and a bit uh, being a bit lazy, to be fair, and got to change it. But it still suits, I reckon. Going off into the sunset on an island all alone. Oh, well, no, in that it's with a friend. Oh, yeah. I'm absolutely loving it. I need to get back on and um, do some more of the story of it because I've still yet to complete it. And um, I've been playing. Um, online quite a bit with a couple of my mates <clears throat> and I've been really enjoying that but uh, the funny thing is most of what we do is um, it's literally just fishing been uh, killing a few dudes on boats getting a boat and then going over to these islands and just doing some fishing make quite a bit of money from it as well yeah I can. Nice. oh yeah it happens with me as well Pim Pim just me not the only one Oh yeah. Awesome ghillie suit that actually helps with uh, protecting you from the rain. See, yeah, I've got a backpack. I've got a belt. Uh, and you can actually hang two tools or two items on the belt. Put things in the backpack. You can, uh, when you're in the process of creating the backpack, you can actually not put the lid on it. And, um, oh no, I'm not sure if it's if you do put the lid on it as well, actually. Um, well, it has like uh, you can place it down and it'll be like a storage storage container basically. Really awesome. So this is one of my uh, outposts. This isn't actually my main camp. Um, yeah, you've got the different biomes. So this is a mangrove forest, and then you've got a swamp biome, and then you've got the tropical biome, which is where I started earlier. And then you have your coconuts, and uh, show you now. So, uh, well, but you can actually cook on the game at the moment. It's only the veg and whatnot. Um, the fruit and that they have said that they'll be adding um, in the next update I think it is with the uh, fish and the crabs and whatnot the ability to cook those which would be pretty sweet yeah to actually cook you've um, actually got to come over the fire and place the stuff next to the fire I think it's awesome I think they have got some sort of idea with this wooden stand of making it so that you can use it as a support to uh, to roast things on and to cook things on. Be pretty sweet. Go through the uh, stats with you quickly as well. You got your basic stamina stat, which uh, which will go down quite drastically if you've not got enough uh, water and calories. And then you got your fatigue. You'll have to sleep once that gets low. Your uh, calorie intake. So once you eat, your calories will go up. Um, you need your calories to do everything as well. Um, and if you don't have your calories, it then burns your body fat, which means that you'll get colder quicker. 
uh, your muscle, an increase in your muscle actually increases your carry weight. Um, water, which actually determines how fast your wounds can heal. That one here. And then your fat. Oh, wait, I've got roasted bananas there, I don't want to burn them. Uh, yeah, and then just left click to eat. Yep, yeah, as you can see, I'm too close to that fire. Oh, yeah, Heat me up too much and cooking me. Um, and I think when you actually take things off the fire, they do still carry on cooking as well. So there's a chance you'll think something's cooked, you'll pick it up. Then it'll uh, carry on cooking. Then get burned. Um, oh wow, the blood actually changes. That never used to change when I last played it. That's awesome. Um, yeah, so you've actually got your uh, your blood levels there. Wait, I never even knew that was there. There's your fat. Um, too much fat will actually reduce your max weight load. Oh wow, I didn't know that either. So you've got to keep fit. And then there's your digesting capability. That's your fullness, so how much uh, room you got left in your stomach. That's um, basically if you're going to have constipation or diarrhea. If you've got a bit of coconut, it's now burned, but because it's still in the shell, which I love, hopefully I haven't left it on there too long. Oh, I actually uh, made it into a roasted coconut. Oh, it was awesome. I never noticed the blood stat working, though. No, the, uh, the muscle and the fat did. Um, and all the others, as far as I know. But I swear down, the blood never worked before I was on it. Um, also, cooking um, cooking does actually affect what the uh, what the food will give back to you. So, for instance, if I look no sure that so cooking the coconut actually makes it contain less fat, cellular sugar, but it can um, and water. But I think it contains more, um, is it, I don't actually, it might contain more water, no, that doesn't make sense. Might be the soil unless it contains more. Oh, right, I didn't realise that they turned to, uh, quite handy to know. Yeah, as you can see here, you've got like a really, really, really in-depth, um, stat system. You know, you can see how much water you got in your body. You can see it slowly being drained. Calories slowly going up as your, um, your food's being burnt down. Your fat, your cellulose, starch, protein. You actually have to have protein in your body. And then whilst doing actions like running around or um, putting down trees, things like that, carrying things, it, um, it'll then turn the protein into muscle. Oh, I, I thought you would. I always, um, I'm sure uh, Snapchat's always told me that you uh, you enjoyed your your survival games. Like I said, I can send you um, see if I can send you a link to the Discord, and you can sort of keep tabs on it then. Um, I like the updates and where to look to and that. Like I was saying as well, because I'm starting to get tired now, my fatigue's gone down, which actually means my, uh, my stamina's drained halfway, so I can only recharge half of my stamina. Yeah. Uh, yeah, if you join their Discord as well, they've got a section in there, which they've, um, they've basically got their roadmap, and you can see everything that they have planned for the game. Like I say though, at the moment it's still very, very early. They've only just started adding uh, the fish and crabs and animals into it. One of the things I'm really looking forward to though is the... Um, is the bows. I remember watching the video that um, the dev done. And it looks awesome. Oh, well, if you enjoy the, uh, the survival genre, you're definitely going to enjoy this. Definitely. 
And yeah, man, I mean, like Craft to say today, there's quite a big, uh, big in-depth chat going on in the uh, in the Discord today. Just going on about the, um, the patch that came out today, which is the one that, where you can actually spear the animals, uh, the fish. Um, I can't wait for the next patch when we can cook them, because that's going to give a proper source of food into the game, like, you know, the fish for your protein and whatnot, so you'll actually be able to build up muscle properly. So I think at the moment you can only get protein from um, drilling open shells and eating shell meat. Um, I thought this was where my building was. I don't think it is. Oh. Hmm. oh yeah man, you gotta love just eating uh just eating clams. Nothing but clams. And then running around with logs. Yeah, man, I'll, um, I'll throw you a link over as soon as um, my stream is done. And uh, yeah, man, once you're in the Discord, just chat away in there, man. They're really, really good group of people in there. The devs are brilliant, and the other, um, the other members of the Discord are brilliant as well. And I'm. Craft, do you know whether the. Um, whether the updates changed the. Seeds and whatnot. Why just on the wrong island? It's can hard to tell because I can't see shit because they're dark lit. I'm gonna be good if I've lost that building, man. That took me ages to do. Uh, if it's changed the seed. Oop. I believe ran into an error. I like that. I don't know where that's gone now. Dead wall, I'll just sleep. Unless I ended up wandering off to a different part of the island. Okay, well. This is one of the big things about this, there is no, um, no map. Um, at all. In the game, as far as I know, I'm not even sure if they're going to be adding a map, to be honest. Pretty cool if they did, or a way of making them up. Come on. Keep away. Yeah, you can uh, can sort of see the different constellations. See if we can get some. Point A if it's not being so clearly. Don't think we can. It is letting it, yeah. The best way to actually sleep is using the bed roll, but unfortunately I don't have one on me. I haven't even looked at the pottery myself, Craft. Not gonna lie. It's something I'm still waiting to look at. Uh, should just slept at my bed until it went daylight. Yeah, I was reading up about it. 
and it, uh, it did seem, or it did sound really cool. The way that they were going on about it. Hmm, now that's where my old fire was. I must have set up another camp somewhere. Away from my main base. It would mean that I'm completely lost. As I cannot remember for the life of me where my uh, main building was. Which is a shame because I... Uh, <clears throat> oh yeah, it's been a while building that. Either that or my main building's just disappeared. Um, right, bear with me two seconds, guys. I am actually just getting a phone call, so I will be back shortly. Thank you for the follow on Twitchcraft, I do appreciate that. Okay, so it appears that I've just um, just got an update on it. Um, 500, 500 megabytes. It shouldn't take me too long to download. I don't know if that's because I've just swapped to um, a different build. I'm not entirely sure. You bear with me. We'll be back in two seconds. Okay guys, I'm back. Uh, oh no, not okay. For some bizarre reason, 
All of my seeds have now disappeared, other than this one. So, I'm not too sure why. Don't know if that's because I've loaded up my other game on the other, on the beta. Um, perhaps. It's going to be a bit annoying because that will mean that I won't be able to um, actually bring back my other one into the other versions. I will have to mention it. Not entirely sure how to get around this. Oh, I do apologise, guys, about all of this. Jumping a bit. Uh, and welcome, Sav Jazz. Just noticed you jump back in. What is it you're hoping you don't need a full reset for? Um, no, I was in the beta earlier when I first came on on my uh, main game. And when I just went back onto the one you just saw then, that was the standard, um, like opting out of the beta. And it's, uh, yeah, it's not got any of my other saves there. It's a bit bizarre. It's only got the one that I haven't used on any other uh, thingy. Okay, the saves aren't compatible that way. What do you mean? Does that mean that I can't use my most uh, my other build on on this one? Ah, uh, right. Okay. So because I've loaded that up into ah uh, fuck, yep, screw myself over there. Ah uh, well, my bad, my bad. <coughs> well, restart won't take too long since you know the mechanics. You'd be surprised if you're talking about um, the Boiland, it will take me a long time to get back to where I was. But luckily, um, I can still use my my other save, it'll just be on the uh, unstable beta one. Um, if you could uh, message me on Discord on how to do that, or on him, I don't mind. I'll have a look about how to do that. Perhaps try and get it back. So it's not that big of an issue, it's just the fact that I can't seem to find my other main hut, but I'll find him at some point. Hopefully. I'm just curious as to why my one building isn't showing up in, in the one save, that's all. It's a bit bizarre. But... Uh, as soon as that has happened, I will probably call my stream and end here. I've actually gone on longer than I was expecting. So, uh, thank you everybody who's came along. Uh, please let me know if you'd like to see more um, more videos on Surviland. As Craft was saying, they've added uh, pottery, which is something I completely forgot about. Um, I haven't even looked at that myself, so I'd, I'd love to jump in and have a look at that. I can properly look at you, uh, look at the building for you. Um, and you know, build the same thing that I did before, but from scratch, because I had such good fun building that. Took me ages, but good fun. Um, I'm trying to think what else. I'm, I feel like I'm missing something else that's been added. In. I haven't looked at it yet. I can't remember what. But yeah, I mean, if you if you guys would love to see uh, Love to see more of Sub Island. Uh, let me know and I'll um, I'll dedicate one day of my streaming to it. So I enjoy playing it. It's a fun game. But yeah, uh, thank you all for coming along and thank you Craft for that uh, that follow on Twitch there. Really do appreciate it. As I was saying earlier on in my um, in my stream, I may be moving over to Mixer and just Mixer, but I'm not too sure yet. I'm in an army about it, so I will see. And uh, yeah, I'll see you all around on the next one. Catch you later, guys. Have fun and peace out.